I'm playing through as many Dragon Ball games as I can get my hands on before I get Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. We've taken down Budokai 1 and 2, so it only makes sense to finish the trilogy. Dragon Ball Z, Budokai 3. Let's get into it. Let's start a new game. All previous game data will be overwritten, okay? So I, um, I jumped in for a second there to have a look at... Like the training mode, uh, I went through like the kind of uh, practice mode to learn all the different mechanics because there's just so many other things that you can do in this game. So yeah, feeling good. Let's start a completely brand new game. We'll jump out the story mode and uh, yeah, let's jump through it. I remembered that it was like, this game's a little bit weirder. It doesn't have the board game mechanics. Instead, you're flying around the map. And I remember finding the Dragon Balls was a little bit harder. So I, um, I have a little walkthrough. We're not going to use it for everything, we're mostly going to use it to find the Dragon Balls. But other than that, we're doing this as a mostly blind playthrough. Alright, so we've got Goku, Gohan, Krillin, Piccolo, Tien and Yamcha. I know that we unlock a couple characters, but since the game loves saving Yamcha to the very end, we might as well do that. Alright, let's, uh, yeah, let's start with Goku. Makes the most sense. Man. Long, long ago. The fact that they've got like the original artwork looks so good. Goku had many adventures while searching for the seven magic Dragon Balls. With his trusted friends by his side, Goku successfully battled many powerful foes. It's a shame they don't get an actual like Dragon Ball story in this. The Earth was attacked by a mysterious warrior race, <laughs> and so, a new battle begins. Okay, oh, so, no... Well, yeah, I guess we're playing Goku's story, so we're not gonna get, like, Piccolo fighting Raditz the way we normally would. Alright, come here, man. Okay, that, that's helpful, the fact that, like, the game is immediately putting you into the customized tray, like, showing you, like, this is how you get your moves. The previous one didn't do that, so that's kind of helpful. Okay. So, yeah, we've got, like, a bunch of locations here. I think if you hit... Yeah, yeah, try and get the map. So before we just jump straight into the fight, we'll go ahead and try and find some of the items. Is that... Oh, dude, World Tournament! Okay! I usually hate these, but I'll take it. Okay. It's been a while, how about you take me on? Oh my god, that's awesome. Uh, dude, you... You won the world tournament. What do you mean, get me back? You won! Okay, first actual fight. Nice. Nice simple combo to start. Oh, okay. Can we knock him out? I would take a ring out, yes! <laughs> okay, we didn't get to show off any of the new mechanics because I was determined to get a ring out there. <laughs> we'll fight properly next time. Okay, this is interesting so far. The, the fact that, like, I liked the board game. The board game was genuinely really, really cool to me. But this is interesting. We've got, like, a, the kind of openness of it. He really didn't, buddy. Oh, what do we get? Another starter vest. Okay, I mean, we've got one of those, but thank you. Oh, like, it's just so cool checking out the map. Like, I really do wish that they'd, uh... Maybe giving us a couple of cutscenes, it would have been a lot cooler to me, but I kind of like this. Wait, what's that? Oh, just a battle point. We can just have a straight up fight? Okay, yeah, let's check that. I, this is a game where, like, having ADHD is definitely going to be a problem. Because, <laughs> like, there's literally shiny things to be distracted by. Of course, it's a Cyberman. It just, it wouldn't be right if we didn't fight a Cyberman, though. <laughs> Take 
Oh, okay. Is this the whole teleport thing? No. No, give me a chance. I really wanted to try it. <laughs> oh man, they've made like the kind of smash attack so much easier to do. Oh, it's so cool, they come out of the ground. That's such a nice sweet detail. Oh, teleport though. That's so cool. <laughs> I feel so much cooler there. The vanish mechanic. Adding that in is so good. Like, that was such a good idea. Oh, is that it? Is that it? They said slightly northeast of the marker. Near there we go. Man, that's gonna be tricky finds. Okay, okay, we've got that first one. Let's, um, yeah, try and find these. Was oh, that Muscle Tower? Oh, sweet. Okay, Dragon Ball should just be here. Okay, the Dragon Radar definitely makes that a lot easier. Which one do we get? Four star, nice. Supposedly it should be around here. I wish you could have both maps up at the same time, it'd make life a lot easier. We're not gonna find that Dragon Ball now. For some whatever reason, I can't seem to spot it. I was in the area that it supposedly is, but that might just be something we have to find at a later time. For now, let's jump in. Let's get the first proper fight done. <laughs> Roots. Very roots. My name is Goku, and I'm from Earth. I'll never join forces with you. Alright, let's do it. <laughs> oh, that vanished though. So, can you teleport off a beam? Let's figure that one out. Oh. Oh, gee, okay, that is blockable. Ah. There we go. I'm trying to practice my timing on those. I have no idea how I just did that, but that was pretty sweet. There we go, there we go. That's pretty hard. Dude! I didn't need to do that. Okay. Oh, I forgot about the wave too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh nice, he's getting taken down by a dinosaur, what a way to end it! <laughs> Is he... Wait, what? How are you still up? I really wanted the dinosaur to end him, that'd have been such a good way to finish it. Why... why you... my partners are already on their way! Destroy you all. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess this is it. God. But I'll keep training in the next world. Wish me back to life in one year. So no. Like again, I, I guess yeah. What a huge power level! <laughs> Time to see if all my training with King Kai paid off. <laughs> Just black screen straight into that. <laughs> So in the context of this, we've not had the Piccolo fight, we've not had Piccolo taking down Raditz and Goku. Yeah, that, maybe this is the game that like you need to know Dragon Ball before you play. Oh, there it is! God, that took ages! I actually got to a stage that I didn't think it was there. Fantastic. Okay, good, good. I'm not gonna lie, that really would have bugged me if we didn't find it. 
All right, planes. Let's jump in. You have learned well, Goku. Your KO Ken technique surpasses even my own. Not sure why we're meeting Ken Kai and the planes, but sure thing. But don't overuse it and never go higher than two times power. <laughs> Do you understand? Sorry, but even two times power might not be enough to beat the opponent I have to face. So is that us got? Nice, okay, that's us got a Kairoken. Okay, let's make sure we equip that. I don't want to, like, a repeat of when I kept on playing the old game and I would... There we go. Yeah, we're not making the same mistake where I keep on forgetting to equip things and going to fights with nothing. Um, are we just going straight back for the fight? Yeah, okay, okay. Oh, okay, it's just Nappa. We can take him. So, like, we really are just doing Goku's fights. Leave now! Otherwise, I'll have no choice but to destroy you! Fair? Ha! Who do you think you are? You think you're any match for me? <laughs> oh, he's got some blue health, too. How? Throwing out blue health this early? Not bad. Ah, damn. I'm trying to remember. There we go. I wonder if I can vanish in response. <laughs> the movement just feels so much better. Damn. Oh. Oh, nice, nice, the slap. Oh, nice. I should have tried to go for something bigger there. And... There he goes. Oh my god, this game feels so much better. Like, so much more in depth, but so much better to play. That rude, man. His fighting days are over, and that's one down and one to go. Okay, so we're just going straight to Vegeta then. Goku, can't we go somewhere else? We already have to wish enough people back as it is. Wish them back, but Piccolo's gone. We can't use the Dragon Ball. <laughs> I get no context. Okay, we finally have a Gohan. That's a that's an interesting Gohan. I'll fill you in on the details later. The fact that they only have like one piece of artwork for every character. It's cool, but maybe a bit lacking in places. Okay, let's do it. I mean, I've already been using Kairoken, but sure. Sure thing, buddy. Also, how is this one not... How is this one not voiced? Like, Nappa got a voice. First time we've had Vegeta. Nothing. These games really do like to disrespect Vegeta. Oh, that's actually a really cool design place. The mountain back's awesome. <laughs> I'm going to enjoy taking my time with you, Kakarot. <laughs> Alright. We'll see about that. I might just have a few surprises in store for you. No, we don't have anything like Spirit Bomb or anything like that. Oh wait, so they made it so you can't hit them while they're down now. Oh yeah, it looks like it. Ah oh, damn, I thought I'd just have my time in there. Oh no! Oh, I didn't see that coming! Oh, is he gonna get like the full thing? Oh, that's so unfo- Oh no, I got it, I got it, I got it. Good. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. Ah, damn. There we go. Oh, but I'm out of energy now. Oh, 
<laughs> yes! Oh, the so. Oh, what? What? Oh, because he got it on a thingy. He got it on like a zipper. I'm not 100 percent sure how to get that right, but we got very lucky there. Right, I need to remember my vanishes. I wish there was a way to like... Okay! I guess not. Like, they showed me the clash there. Again, you look really smug in the photo, but like, you've just got your ass kicked. Fight again sometime, Vegeta. Alright, what do we get? What do we get? Oh, okay, we just straight up got Vegeta. Does he have a story? Like it would it would make sense if he had one. Having successfully fended off the Saiyan onslaught, Goku opts to spare Vegeta's life. Right. Mark my words, you'll pay for this, Kakarot, you and all of your friends! Yeah, like, obviously that worked out to be the, you know, overall better choice, Vegeta obviously being quite useful to the series. But, like, at the time, that was a mess play, bro. Krillin, Gohan, and Bulma travel to Namek in the hopes of reviving their fallen friends. All right, uh, right, that seems like a good place to end this one, at least. But, yeah, so far I'm into this game, like... It's so much more in-depth than the other one was, and I'm going to practice the timing on some of the things because the sway back mechanic, that's so good. Like I got to use it a couple times, but the vanish mechanic, that's gonna be that's gonna be key. Uh but yeah, we're gonna play through this story mode, we'll play through a few of the other ones. I might I might go for all of them, we'll see how we feel, but yeah, let's go with that. I will see you in the next one.